on my mom's Acura TL. My brother was supposed to do the oil change, but he's super, super busy, and uh, I can do it because I've done it on my BMW a bunch of times. My mom was super skeptical, didn't even let me do it, but now she kind of is like, okay, but she said, if you mess something up or spill oil, you're... you're... So, yeah, we're going to do it right now real quick. Uh, shouldn't be too hard because I've done it like two, two or three times on my BMW. So, uh, yeah, let's do it. It's a tight space, but we got it in the garage super tight space like literally no clearance but i have enough to fit the jack i'm gonna pull out the spare wheel out of the trunk and put it under just for safety then i can just unscrew the bolt put it in the pan yada 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 okay so i'll, I'll put you guys in the tripod it is getting late on us this jack really sucks but got it jacked up just enough for me to fit in there and an oil pan to fit in there so uh now i just gotta slide in a spare wheel so if anything it falls on the spare wheel and uh, try to find that oil drain bolt. Alright, so I slid the oil pan under and the bolt was actually a 17, which is bigger than I thought, but yeah, it's a 17, so let's take a pull. Nice and black. So I got the oil drained. Uh, there's the plug. Um, so yeah, I got that drained. But now I gotta get to the filter. Can you guys see that? Right there, that's the filter. Seems like there's a little bit of oil leaking out of it or something on the O-ring, but uh, yeah, now we gotta take out that. I have a special tool for that this thing so it's gonna might be a pain in the ass and it might not so let's see the tool didn't work but then i just tried my hand and it literally screwed up all right so we're gonna be putting uh, a new oil filter in that one was a bosch one this one i got the k n stuff the good stuff for my mom's car and i won't need a special tool all i need is just uh i just need a socket for it so that's cool so uh, let's install this onto the car. This is the oil that came out of it. Now I'm about to put it back in. Alright guys, it's been about a month since I, since that last clip and um, I was just too busy and I was working and if you guys saw my last video I got a skyline and uh, so yeah I've been busy with all that, uh, school started just back up, I got some time to edit when I came home from school so I guess I'm going to start doing YouTube videos again, I kind of just took like a month break but yeah guys, uh, this is the car, I didn't record putting back the filter back on I did do it a little tight but I didn't strip it so the filter's alright, nothing's leaking I didn't oil even the o-ring around it, which I should have but it's not leaking at all uh, so it's all good it's like, it's right there so um, yeah, it's pretty clean the hex, I mean the the socket little thing on the bottom really helps. And uh, it also didn't record me putting back the drain bolt. But I did all that stuff, guys. So don't worry. Um, and it's been about a month. And my mom's been driving it. And it's been driving all good. So no really, no problems. So yeah, it was a success. And if you guys are wondering, I did reset the computer inside the car. The oil life thing. So it reminds you when to change the oil. I did reset that. Everything is all good. 
it was a fairly simple job if you guys want to watch more like kind of car videos let me know down below uh because i'll definitely do that and uh yeah i'll see you guys later peace